Hi everyone, welcome to Cloud Patashala channel. My name is Kiran. Today, I'm going to uh, give some information about Microsoft certifications. Why especially this video I'm creating here? Because of a lot of learners, uh, like my friends, some colleagues, uh, some other members outside, and they're asking, okay, right now I'm working as a developer. Right now I'm working as a dynamic uh, uh, Microsoft Dynamics. I'm working as a something um, on-premises exchange or active directory and as a security engineer or it's an infra admin or storage admin or Linux admin or Windows administrator like that. But which certification is a suitable for me? I want to upgrade myself as a skills. That skills, I want to upgrade myself. So in this scenario, which exam I need to write and get the certification because of Nowadays, you can see guys in all MNC companies, all companies are who are certified and even they are forcing to do certification on the cloud platform, especially Azure is a very popular nowadays and most opportunity available on the Microsoft Azure platform. That's the reason in all companies, not only Azure, it's a other cloud platform also they are asking, but especially right now we are going to understand about Microsoft certification which certification is a suitable for us that way you know i'm going to explain here guys try to understand if you have any questions anything you can post in the comments and um, i can try to reply as early as possible and one more thing before going to start please if you are not subscribed please subscribe my channel and if you like the video you can like this video and um, you know uh, share with your friends and colleagues even it's very helpful to everyone. Yes, coming to here, this is a URL I will provide in the description. In this video description, I will provide it. It's over the internet, you can able to access it. And this URL using that, you can see Microsoft, what they are providing variety of certifications here. So if you see, there are five categories like Azure, Dynamic 365, Microsoft 365, our platform, security, compliance, identity categories. There are five categories. Before jump into this category, different exams. And before that, you can understand guys, clearly mention full certification title, that certification title they are providing here, as well as they are mentioned some of the certifications related star mark and lock symbol, as well as two here mentioned. What exactly this is the one? First, we'll try to understand after that i'm going to bit uh, explain about these all those things coming to here if you observe what exactly they are saying that it's a star mark is available means that certificate is a expert certification expert certification that means and that expert certification before that you should complete that fundamentals or some of the certification must and should you need to completed i hope so i can see that way most of the time like example ag400 azure devops if you want to get the certification or the batch before that you must and should complete the ag104 or ag204 that means azure administrator associate certification or azure developer associate certification you should complete it so that only you can get the certification you can get the certification and even they clearly mention that certification as a prerequisites so if you want to get this certificate that prerequisite wise you need to complete it so this is a star mark means expert certification lock symbol means before that you need to complete it and what about this exam requirements if there is a two courses sometimes some related certification you must and should write the these two exams after that only you will get the that relevant certificate you will get it if you pass one exam also you won't get it the that particular certification that means that certificate and batch you won't get it guys you must and should the both the exams both the course and so that you will get the certification so that is a uh, you know information about this one and coming to categories wise let's look into that categories and some of the things i will explain it here and we'll try to understand. First of all, what Microsoft saying that fundamentals, 
generally if you want to understand the azure related ag 900 ag 900 if it is a zoom at you can observe and hopefully it's everyone able to see properly azure fundamentals ag 900 ea 900 that means artificial intelligence 900 and data fundamentals that is a dp 900 and same like dynamic 365 also mb 910 mb 920 same like microsoft 365 also ms 900 same like for security and compliance also and it's a sc 900 as well as power platform pl 900 is available these are the basic and the fundamental certification guys basic and fundamental certification after that if you scroll down there is a role base expand your technical skill set so what exactly this is one means depends on your interest based on your experience which roles you are suitable for that accordingly you can choose the right certification suppose if you are infra guy and you can go with the azure administrator associate like windows server administrators linux server administrators and kind of storage administrators or network engineers or kind of all the people can learn even it's anyone can learn there is no problem at all but if you learn mostly in this course explain about and discuss about infrastructure related same like for developers azure developer associate ag204 and same like security azure security engineer associate these are the majorly we can see most of the time as well as one more certification that is a ag305 below you can observe guys ag305 this especially solution architect expert certificate so clearly seeing guys star mark as well as lock symbol is available same for devops also that means before that you need to certify ag104 for solution architect expert certificate same like for devops also before that you need to write exam and get the certification on the ag104 or ag204 at least one of the certificate we need to do it otherwise this exam if you write it you won't get that batch and certificate guys you won't get that batch and certificate you won't get it that's the reason clearly mentioned star mark and lock symbol here okay so this is a generally we can see most of the certifications this one other than that you can observe guys lot of certifications is available so here azure stack hub this is a kind of private cloud if you want learn azure private cloud that is a called azure stack hub operator associate and ag600 course as well as only networking azure networking you want expertise and you can go with the ag700 and you can see guys if you are working as a windows administrator as well as you are going to support in azure platform as a hybrid engineer like windows server hybrid administrator associate there is a two course ag800 ag801 these are the two courses you need to give the exam two courses you need to learn as well as two exams you need to provide it so that you will get the certification of windows server hybrid administrator associate certification so that you are like can able to manage understand how is a name relation happen azure to on premises and how is the integration active directory and file servers as well as license and everything you can learn guys on this course and as well as a engineer artificial intelligence engineer data scientist data scientist is a kind of nowadays is a very popular you know and data engineer especially you can learn here the kind of data factory uh, synapse analytics and a kind of uh, snowflake or big data like that in azure platform how you can use it those things you can learn from dp203 and as well as azure database administrator that means dp300 especially sql administrator can learn on this and more they can get the knowledge and uh, you know uh, idea about how to migrate to on-prem to azure platform what are the methods is available everything you can get the more idea guys like azure administrator associate so like that you can see each and every category wise there are a lot of different category exams is available like dynamic 365 also you can see guys fundamentals wise crm erp and other marketing functional consultant and sales functional consultant 
like that so many different variety of certifications is available some of the certifications is of both the exams you need to write and get the certification after that only you are certified that re relevant uh, certification even before that that prerequisite and expert certificate everything is uh, available same like dynamic 365 how is the thing same like you can see guys microsoft 365 also on this especially you can learn about microsoft teams that related security and voice and teams administrator enterprise administrator expert modern desktop like it's a kind of intune endpoint and so many things you will learn in this and teams application developer also said these courses you will get it from this so in this you can see guys expert and specialty related especially exchange online support engineer specialty and team support engineer specialty is a separate specialty exams also is available guys you can scroll left and you can see here sap you, you are trying to migrate from on premises sap server to azure platform if you learn and get certified you are certified you can able to migrate from on premises to azure platform that sap workloads sap workloads to azure platform same like virtual desktop that means vdi like how is the vmware vdi and citrix vdi same like azure is a providing the vdi and azure platform that is a called azure virtual desktop specialty exam as well as azure support engineer connectivity specialty that means troubleshooting related especially this is a one and ag 720 and iot developer specialty cosmos db developer specialty and customer data platform specialty like that different specialty exams is also available guys different specialty exams also is available and same like you can see guys it's a power platform especially uh, like i heard about some of the sharepoint people and uh, nowadays they are uh, managing and using this power platform okay and it's a tableau power bi like how is the thing same like power bi data analysis related and rpa automate the things power automate rpa developer associate power platform solution architect and power platform developer associate power platform uh, functional consultant associate like that pl it will start from that okay and security related ag 500 it's available under azure as well as under security compliance and identity related also is available under that you can see different certifications se 300 400 ms 500 sc 200 sc 100 it's entirely security related guys as well as you can learn about more security related to identity platform infrastructure related all type of security you can learn about here like sentinel kind of uh, everything kind of uh, you know microsoft defender cloud and uh, firewalls and everything you can learn from this guys so totally these are the different variety of certifications guys and one more point i want to understand okay so still i am getting this little bit confused uh, how two or three certifications is a uh, uh, like i am interested and what are the topics is going to cover in this course you want understand just double click or right click on that open link in new tab if you open like this and that relevant certification it will show you what are the skills you are going to learn here so you can see manage azure identity and governance implement and manage the storage deploy manage azure compute resources configure manage the virtual networking monitor and maintain the azure resources these are the topics you are going to learn so if you want more something like two exams i mentioned same thing you can right click on that and go to here and you can see what exactly mentioned certification exam administrating windows server hybrid core infrastructure configure windows server hybrid advanced services both the exams if you write you will get this certificate and what are the things you are going to learn these are the topics you are going to learn about on this course guys on this course you are going to learn on this and one more point guys if you scroll down little bit here and that particular learning path that means you can learn yourself you can learn yourself microsoft given the very good uh, approach or scenario base and it's kind of you know you can read yourself try to understand the uh, concepts here it's a concept 
so that relevant certification related concepts here available some of the knowledge checks is also is available some of the certification related sandbox environment also they are providing like that everything is a uh, available guys so i hope it's uh, this video it's a uh, very helpful to everyone and if you are like it you can comment and uh, subscribe my channel and share with your friends and colleagues so that it's everyone can able to help you on this uh, everyone get the benefit on this guys thank you everyone have a nice day